day, public school is actually teaching you how to day trade, guys. So let's jump oh, right into it. Welcome back, passive income investors alike. Today, I got something really interesting I want to talk about, and this really hits a close to my heart. One of my, oh, actually, my business partner's daughter uh, is attending public school, guys. She's 14 years old. She's just about to head off to high school. But uh, toward the end of the semester here, there's a guy that came into her school that is actually teaching them about stocks. Now, this is a lot different than in my day, because if you were like me, when you were in school, chances are nobody taught you about taxes, finance, stocks, or working for yourself. That's something you probably had to learn on your own. But there's a few problems that I have had, and my uh, business partner keeps telling me not to stir the pot because I keep asking his daughter to ask them questions, because essentially they're competing them in a game to win two thousand dollars so from my understanding essentially what is going to happen here is the kids have gotten trading accounts uh, virtual accounts where they have a hundred thousand dollars to spend they have to buy four positions and whoever makes the most fictional money in the next three months toward the end of the semester is going to essentially win a two thousand dollar prize pot and this sets off so many red flags in my investment philosophy that <clears throat> I almost want to question these people they're bringing into the schools because uh, even this morning as my business partner's daughter is texting me and telling me that there's people that made a hundred dollars in like five minutes that it feels like they're really inciting gambling into the school system which makes me really want to make a video about how annoying this is to me personally I'm going to pick probably four basic stocks for her I would like to put at least half of that into like a Vanguard index fund and then the other half divided up between Apple and Facebook and hope for the best over the next three months so really quickly um, just here's the account they're giving them guys uh, it's an interesting little website I've never seen before it's called how the markets work .com. and I'll show you the portfolio I set up for her. you guys can tell me if you think this is good bad or if you do it differently so they have to pick four stocks twenty five thousand in each we went with apple tesla vanguard i think tesla's a good buy right now it seems pretty cheap it's down quite a bit even though they have new model cars coming out guys which we're gonna get to see the sales on very soon um, we got the vanguard 500 index fund just to add some stability to the portfolio and another stock that i think is far too cheap right now which is Facebook. So this is just a really quick overlook of the accounts that they're using that I've set up for her. Um, so yeah, it'll be neat to see uh, how this works out. In the words of Warren Buffett, guys, I don't know what the market's going to do three months from now, six months from now, a year from now. But 10 years from now, I can tell you that the stuff that I own today is going to be worth a hell of a lot more. And under all the investment philosophy I've ever received, guys, I have never um, inspired toward day trading. Even all the best day traders I know, guys, some of them last year, their entire year of profits came from five full trading days. That means out of all the dating trades last year, if they weren't in front of that desk for five of those days, that if they missed one of those five days out of the whole year, they wouldn't have made any money or they wouldn't have made nearly as much. And I don't think it's appropriate to aspire kids to sit there and look at numbers going up and down and think that is how someone makes money in the stock market. It is truly unimpactful in my opinion. They should be focusing more on long term investing and finding companies that are going to be stable and solidifiable and i don't know how else you can teach a kid this because you can't do it overnight kids are so young and just what i'm trying to explain to my business partner's daughter is that you'll never see this actually um actualize in such a short amount of time sure your friends might be making a hundred bucks here and there fictionally trading a hundred grand but honestly in the real world I think you're better off holding long term. Um, I don't know if you guys do any day trading. You can let me know in the comment section below. I absolutely hate it. I hate sitting behind a desk and watching numbers go up and down and trying to play the, uh, the technicals and thinking that's life. I, I'd much rather just collect dividends, pick really good, strong companies I understand and that I love and let them curate over my lifetime and pay me monthly or quarterly and just use that money as I please and go out and do whatever I want whenever I want. I can go swimming in the afternoon, guys. I mean, 
it's Friday afternoon now and I'm making this video for you. I wouldn't be doing this if I had to sit beside my desk and start analyzing numbers and clicking the mouse over and over again trying to make a profit. I just don't enjoy that lifestyle. And there's a very few people that make a good living day trading, guys. And it's not something I think that is appropriate to be teaching in school. I think they needed to teach you how to invest, not how to trade, because when you speculate, you're technically gambling. And I mean, why can't we just take $100,000 and go put it on red in the casino and double our money instantly? I mean, it's essentially the same thing in my opinion. You might as well be teaching her to do a quick options play if we're talking about making two grand in three months, guys. is essentially the competition, right? So she has three months to make as much as she can. If she makes more than anybody else, she'll win 2,000 real dollars, which if that's how the school is teaching them how to use money in the stock market, chances are they're going to lose that two grand the second um, they're allowed to use it if they are giving them the option of putting it into a trading account. I think it's absolutely absurd and ridiculous. Though I guess we all have to start somewhere. And even when I started, I started with day trading guys. Anything I've learned from any major investor, there's a guy from Google that just talked that made billions of dollars trading in the markets and he even said that he thought he could outbeat the markets by picking individual stocks but as time has gone on over his life he realizes that if he just sunk all his money in the Vanguard index fund or just an S&P 500 index that he probably would have done just the same. So I really want you to let me know in the comments section below what you guys think. I hope you enjoyed this quick video. I gotta head off to do some shows today guys. Joys of being a magician so I will see you probably on Monday.